Hi guys and girls, Greg here, KC8YTO, Kilo, Charlie, 8, Yankee, Tango, Ocean, gonna tell you about the solar data, the little app, the gadget that uh, sits on your desktop and lets you know all the conditions you need to know if there's a CME coming your way. So anyway, uh, I went online to look for it again and I found it on here and I clicked on this link and up came the gadgets from Microsoft and it said, ah, oh, gadgets have been discontinued and some stupid privacy statement. Ah, well, I'm going to make it available for you and I'm going to show you how to do it. Just click the link in the description below to get the solar gadget. When you download it, you'll be downloading this file. It's called solargadget.zip. We're going to right click on it and we're going to extract, uh, extract it right here and what you end up getting I'm gonna probably put a information file in there too but this is the folder you're interested in right here solar data gadget file okay this needs to go in a folder in Windows so put that there let's open up another winder in Windows, and here's where we gotta go C and then program files and we're going to go down to Windows Sidebar. It's all alphabetical. Go inside Windows Sidebar and then go inside Gadgets. All right, there might be some in there and might not be these in here. It depends on what you have. They've been discontinued, but this is a cool gadget and it's good for uh, ham amateur radio. We're just going to move this over here to Solar Gadget. Go ahead, close that out, close that out. You could even erase that file if you want to. We're going to right click on our desktop and select gadgets. Now I'm running Windows 7 32-bit. I've heard that this doesn't work in 64-bit. So I don't know. You can try it and you can leave some comments. And I look and here's my solar data gadget by N0NBH. I'm gonna double click on it and it's gonna put it right there. The only problem, now it's gonna update every three hours or so and tell you the conditions. As of right now, 80 meters is pretty good and 12 and 10 meters is pretty poor but at any rate the only uh, anomaly with this is that it's stuck in the right corner you can't move oh I can move it now well <laughs> dig that alright so you can move it around wherever you find it's it looks good on your desktop and I don't know why it's moving now but click the link to below in the description and download this little file for your desktop and be aware of all the solar terrestrial data you can get 73 kilo charlie 8 yankee tango ocean